to our culture. So out of the 10 emails I send in a month to all of you, nine of them are related to culture, different parts of it. We deliberately talk about culture a lot because everything that we want, all the expectations we have, all the numbers we look at, all those results we share on a daily basis are emerging properties of culture. So if we, all of us, share the same values at the same level and truly exercise them at necessary levels, results will manifest the implementation of these values. Does that make sense? We talk about it a lot. And we are very deliberate in building a culture that we want. Every organization has a culture. They may not even talk about it. They may not even know it. But every organization, like every country, has a culture. We have our own. I'm not saying our culture is the best. I'm not even saying it's good. I'm not saying it's bad, but it's ours. Anyone who comes here and wants to become successful, they need to embrace our values. And again, I'm not saying these are great values, but they're ours. Right? So it's important to understand these values, make sure we live them, we behave them, we share them, and we make it a part of everything that we do. So we have lots of components to our culture, lots. But I want to focus on just a few today. Competitiveness. As friendly as everybody else is here, this is the most competitive group of professionals I've ever worked with. I am not kidding. Do you all agree? Yeah. I am not kidding. When lists go out every day, I guarantee you, whether it's admissions, business office, SAMS, whether it's you know, collections, education, career services, student finance, everybody goes looks for their name. Where am I today? Where am I this week? Is that true or not? Yeah. And if you're number one, guess what you do? You go look at number two, three, four, five, say, <laughs> say, look at you poor suckers. <laughs> <laughs> look where you ended up. But of course, you know, on the calls, uh, yeah, I got lucky this week. Number two, three, four, and five are much better than I am. Uh, you know, deep down inside you're saying, yes. I am number one and I deserve it. And if you're number five, you know what you do? You say, Darn it, next week I'm going to move up. Because that number one guy, I have to prove to her and to him I'm better. This is the culture. Do you agree? Do you agree? We are a competitive culture. We are a very, very, com more so than anywhere I've been. Right? 